This is a video about what to buy when the Lumineth come out this week. Hello, this is 60 Goblins in One Brush with a video about what to buy when the Lumineth will come out this week. On the 5th of September and the 12th of September 2020, you'll finally be able to pre order your Lumineth. Finally! But what to buy? Oh my god! But seriously, it seems that they will come out in two batches. I don't know what else that could mean over two weeks, maybe in three batches, but I think there will be two batches. And you have to decide if you want to play all the Lumineth or if you want to play the classical straight elves or the mountain elves, like the stone guard and the battle cattle spirit of the mountains. My elf specialist from Korea, Ingo, he will go for the wardens and techless and so on while I will go for the stone guard and the spirit of the mountains. So my guess is that they will first release Teclis and the Battle Tome and the Wardens and the Sentinels and the Cathalas and Eltherion. And then in the second patch one week later, the Spirit of the Mountain, a Valinor, the Stoneheart King and the Stone Guard, which you can also use as a battle line if you play Metrica. And the Stone Mage, of course. So if you want to go for Metrica and the stone magic and so on, you probably have to wait a week longer, but then you have to buy all of it. There's, there's no options really. You have to buy lots of stone guard, maybe a few wardens or sentinels, and then the stone heart king and another mountain spirit and at least two mountain mages. If you want to play straight old-fashioned high elves, you want to buy a lot of wardens and a lot of sentinels. Lots and lots of lots. Then you need Scenery Cathalas. Two would be good. Eltherion is too good to be missed. And then you have to decide if you want to play Teclis or not. Probably you do. That's the biggie. The big magician. There's a joke in the new article that he's the greatest wizard of all times because Nagash only knows the one law. The Dawn Riders are objective scrubbers but they suck at fighting really. The Wardens are great and the Sentinels are great and that's basically it. Then you need the Battle Tome of course if you don't have it already and then is the question with the Endless Spells. You need the Haitian Twin Stones. They're too powerful not to take them. They're great. You can store up magical energy and make your Scenery Cathalas much more powerful. The Scenery Cathalas are not named characters, so you can and will take more of them. And my Elf Specialist says that if you're playing the Mountain Faction, then the Sanctum of Amuntok in the Rune of Petrification also worth taking. So you probably want the endless spells as well. And then there are these weird new dice, realmstone dice, that look like crystals. Nice idea, but let's see how they are on the playing field. I think it's always a bit annoying if you can't read the numbers well. I'm still planning some more painting videos. Ethereum, for example, maybe Techless, definitely the Stone Guard and the Battle Cattle. Grab your sentinels while they're still hot. Tell me what you think, what you will buy, what you want to buy, what you don't want to buy, which direction you want to go. You want to play all the Lumineth or only the hardcore traditional ones or the Stone Guard Mountain Spirit ones. This will not be a cheap army. It's not an easy army to play. It has turned out, although uh, the models are and the rules are quite powerful, you have to really think it's a synergy-rich army and it will be an expensive army. So you need to buy a lot of Wardens and Sentinels and batches of 10. That will be costly. But it will be great fun to shoot your enemies to smithereens. My friend Franz is trying out um, City of Sigma presently 
and it's really hard to get there without being shot into pieces. It's really good to have a good artillery. So leave your comments below. What will you get? Thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. And see you pretty soon. As soon as the Luminith are actually out. Actually able to buy in the shops. On the shelves. There will be another giveaway. Because uh, this channel has passed 300 subscribers. Thank you very much.